You guys ready for the world infamous disco list? Boom. Yes, I am. Yeah, without a doubt. It's been a while. It's been a while. It has been backed by popular demand. Uh, let's start off with the Canadian con- contingency. Cyrus, Lord Cyrus, Lance, Lord Cyrus. He's still, it's definitely still on the list. Did you see that there was uh, the promo that Cyrus cut uh, on Impact last week or something like that? Meltzer said it's the best that uh, a segment like that could ever get on pro wrestling television. Of course he said, dude. He yeah, did. Against, so, when he cut the promo on Rich Well, but, but Don, Don, Don has been carrying Kenny on the mic in this, like, like for, for his character, you yeah. know? Well, th- back in I the mean, day. He's been, he, bro, Don is an entertaining ca- on-air character. Yeah. Back in you the day, You know what I think? I think we finally real, we were, we're remembering this. I mean, he's still, bro, he's, he's, he's even very entertaining behind the scenes. Right. You know, working well, with the, it's just a, he's well, a great, he, John is an excellent entertainer. Yeah, but he's not, still on the disco list for his disrespect sure. video when I went on the show, you know? <laughs> yeah. And uh, plus, not only that, people caught a glimpse of how entertaining he was when you and him were going at it at the beginning, remember? Yeah. Yeah. And, that was uh, great. And, and, you know, yeah, he's super entertaining. Bro, Don's guy. work is no different than his 2003 run in, in, in Impact, right, where he was right. excellent. Yeah. Right. You know, he came in as an authority figure. He, yeah. He went up, he just, he could, the guy cuts a... It's probably a great character. And before he's that, across, he's a little. He's he. I will say this: they are being a little bit too over the top comedically on some of these things. You know what I'm saying? But but he's still he's 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 carrying that angle. You know. Well, before yeah. that, he did the authority figure in ECW, and just before that, he did commentary with Styles. And what I was going to say was, like when I was younger, if the commentary team was Gorilla and Heenan, you knew it was going to be entertaining because Bobby's there the whole show. He's going to make it fun even if the matches stink or whatever. Cyrus was the same way. When he commentated with Joey Styles, he took their pay-per-views to another level. He, even though Joey was good, having Don there, feeding off Joey and making him laugh and all that, that was great okay, stuff. Do you see, just so you know, for, just so you know, there was a time when Joe was trying to get Cyrus to do a podcast and I have a feeling this over-the-top Thing he just set up him so he could send them a clip and tr- talk them into doing a podcast. The opportunity Would is I always correct, there. Joe? The opportunity is always there, Mr. Callis. That's what I call it. All right. Him. Go ahead, uh, <laughs> D.I. 